All right, good morning, good morning. Oh my gosh. Circle of you, yes. As I look down and I come out here, my I, I have a little meditation and prayer. And I ask for the spirit of uh, understanding and guidance to be upon me. And to understand that these, all these bricks right here, are potentials and realities that truly do exist. These are representation, yes, I understand. But understand also our brains and our words have to be cohesive with the with the energies and the vibration of who we are because we're energy each one of us so I, I walk on this circle of you and it doesn't matter which direction you walk but i built this so i could uh, train my mind to understand that there's other possibilities uh, available in any situation and it has worked remarkably well as i go through every day we just was up in visiting a parents in Tennessee and my father-in-law a good man served in Vietnam we appreciate him love him but he's not awake and so I uh, was talking to him about just this new energy and about what we're about what we're about a little bit and I said uh, you're the master of your creator you know you control it all and he kind of scoffed at that a little bit but then I said you know we're going out to eat and he said it's all we're going to to the Texas Roadhouse and <laughs> He says, he says, this is always crowded. There's never a place to park. It's not a good time to go. I said, not only is it a good time to go, we're going to drive up there. There's going to be light traffic getting there. And there's going to be one space for you up at the parking lot. And also, we're not going to have to wait to go in there, which all that spoken, uh, we was getting online going in there that we were uh, coming in there as as uh, customers you know making a reservation and so we made the reservation uh, for as we arrived and we there was people there waiting but we didn't have to wait we went right in there and sat down and it was a remarkable experience and he said this never happened before as far as finding a space and the crowds were like because it's a new texas roadhouse and they're always a big fanfare but we went drove right in there and it was wonderful everything happened exactly every tit and toddle that happened that we spoke about of what would occur on travel there and parking there and all that and so he got a little a little taste of the energy of manifestation and i want to share with you each one of y'all I, I when i spoke that i spoke against someone who did not believe but i did i already knew because i understand the realities and and the multiple realities available because of this structure my brain clearly understands that i could choose a reality as long as i can believe in it yeah, that's the whole key. You know, your mind controls it all. You have to understand that you have great power. And you've been hidden from that great power for so many years. So many generations. Uh, we're all born into this dark energy. We're under dark energy now. We have to break out and see the light. It's all part of God's plan. There's no Savior in the middle, although we appreciate the teachings and the life of the Master Jesus of Nat Nazareth. Um, yeah, I've read the Bible. Um few times i've read other spiritual writings i read the book of mormon probably about nine or ten times cover to cover uh, being a former church a member of the church of jesus christ of latter-day saints i appreciate the growth and learning i received in the church but at the same time they steal your power you get all the way there you're obeying the rules of light and then you get there you give your power away to a being who has already come and gone in a hierarchy into a system that is set up by dark energy. And that sounds harsh. But uh, the spirit of Christ is within me each day. The spirit of love. The spirit of charity. And that's what it's all about. But you get these in here. You tell your body and your spirit that you want to be able to see and understand there's other realities. And there's other things. So when I built this. Let me just get back to this real, real quick. When I built this. I had built it as a fireplace. I saw the vision first. You know, wife wanted a, fire, a fireplace. So I put, I, I saw this finished, you know, this construction finished way back then, you know. I didn't see the seating area that was added on as an afterthought, but I needed that to be able to meditate and to ponder on these uh, quartz stones. These are white quartz and all that. But anyway, it works quite well. And I just found it's very effective. that sometimes at night I'm sitting and I'm just quiet and I can hear, I well, I'm not going to say that. It's going to sound like I'm a nut, but uh, these other realities exist, and they're real, and you're part of them. You're in them right now, okay? But uh, 
don't be afraid and you control it all and may love fill your hearts oh i never introduced who i am david abraham this is june uh, 7th i believe or 8th 2023